It's Texting Tuesday, and our script today is a personal invitation, a, uh, a script to personally invite your contacts, your database to do something, to check something out, to register for something, to come do something, whatever the case may be. There are lots of ways that you can shape this one uh, and utilize this script depending on what you're doing and uh, you know whatever opportunities you have. I'm going to use one specifically uh, today um, that uh, you know you may or may not be able to replicate, but I'll give you ideas how you can uh, with other you know with other uses of this script. Good morning, uh, Adrian. Thank you for that. If you are watching on Facebook, do me a huge favor: hit the like button or the heart button. If you're watching this live on YouTube or after the fact on YouTube, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Be sure to smash the bell to be notified of new live sessions and be sure to hit the like button on the actual video itself. Number three, if you're watching on a LinkedIn, hit the like, uh, like button or the light bulb button. Uh, we've getting, been getting more and more uh, folks watching on LinkedIn, which is awesome. Mike, good morning to you, sir. Once again, we're gonna be using the invitation real estate text and email script to create conversation opportunities with your clients and specifically with this one to get your potential clients or past clients or sphere of influence or whoever you've got in your database to take some specific action, to take some specific action. And um, for me, what I'm going to be inviting people to do is download our new local home search app. Okay, so I'm going to get into that uh, in a minute. Uh, but first, I want to highly recommend that you check out the additional resources, training classes, and unique offers that we've got above or below this video, including the fact that we are very aggressively looking to partner with producing agents, uh, agents who are currently actively producing and looking to grow their production in the next 12 months. And there are three different ways that we can partner together. Um, so there are lots of opportunities for us to do that. Check out the additional information above or below, or just schedule a time to chat with me at growwithjosh.com forward slash chat. Vanessa Bez says, thank you. Well, thank you, Vanessa. Appreciate you being here and spending some time. Okay. So our personal invitation, real estate text and email script. Um, before, before we do that, actually, um, I want to know in the comments, in the comments, um, have you ever participated in or hosted a home buyer or home seller workshop? And I'll explain why, because I'm going to give that as a use case. I'm going to explain why I'm asking that. So let me know in the comments, yes or no, have you ever hosted or participated in a home buyer workshop or a home seller workshop or something along those lines, maybe even a a, a workshop for renters that want to buy, you know, something like that. Uh, and so the answers coming in so far are no. Okay. Uh, that actually is very helpful and useful. Uh, maybe we need to do a session on that um, and uh, and dive into that. Denise says, yes. All right. So we've got our first yes. Uh, not yet. Someone says, I like that. Not yet. Uh, I like uh, the yet on the end of that. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We are going to, well, actually, before I do this, before I share my screen and, and dig into um, KV Core, Vanessa says, yes, via Zoom in September. Awesome. I would love to hear more, Vanessa. Maybe you can uh, send me a private message. I would love to hear more about how that went. Um, I'd love to chat with you about that. Okay, so before I share my screen and get into KV Core, I mentioned already the personal invitation I'm going to be sending out is to invite contacts in my database to come and check out my new uh, phone app, the Central PA Home Search phone app. And I'm going to bring it up here. And um, it's an app on their phone. They can download on their phone. It looks like uh, it looks like that in the App Store. And the reason why I've invested into having that or into having this built and created for me is I wanted yet another way for people to connect with us and with me. And 
more and more people are living on their phones and not on their laptop or their desktop. And so if I can have another way of connecting with them by this beautiful little handheld computer that's in there, well, sometimes mostly beautiful, but sometimes evil, um, uh, that that people are you know attached to, I thought all the better. So if you'd like more information about the company I use to do this, it's not cheap. Um, you can you can comment below or send me a private message. However, you don't need to go to that length to utilize this idea because many of you, many of you, your MLS gives you a free app. Or for example, KV Core gives you an app that you can uh, have folks download, okay? So there are other ways that you can utilize this specific script and, and, uh, and process that I'm going to, to utilize today. More importantly, is that this invitation framework you can use with lots of different ideas. It would not, does not have to be a, a mobile app that you're asking people to download, okay? So one of the reasons why I asked about workshops is you could have a personal invitation for them to come join you at a, whether it's virtual or in-person, home buyer workshop or home seller workshop. You could have a personal invitation inviting them to, uh, you know, we're coming up on Thanksgiving and the holidays here. You could invite them. Maybe you're doing a pie day where you're giving away pies. Um, or maybe you're doing some sort of other client appreciation event. You could send a personal invite via text and email to, uh, to you know, invite them to that, right? So there's lots of ways that you can use this script beyond the specific application that I will be using right now. I would love to know in the comments below as well, um, yes or no, do you have an app that you can invite people to utilize? And you might want to check in your with your MLS. Your MLS may have one uh, for you um, that, that you, and you didn't even, you know, you weren't even aware of, or whatever platform you're using, they may have a phone application that you can invite people to utilize and create just another, or not just another, create another way that you can stay, um, create and stay top of mind, create top of mind awareness and stay top of mind with your uh, prospects and contacts and potential clients. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen here. Normally, normally, I would start by filtering and sending a text message. But I'm actually going to start with the email version of this script first and foremost. So I'm still going to go to my smart CRM. Still going to go to my smart CRM. And I'm still going to filter and send because I want to make sure to have the most current um, uh, segment of the list to send this email script to, Okay. And um, in a moment, or in a couple of moments, I'll let you know how you can get the free resource that we put together on each and every one of these that includes all of the resources, templates, scripts, et cetera. I will let you, uh, I will let you in on that in just a moment. But I'm going to check. I'm going to choose prospect, new lead, and active lead. I'm going to choose contact details. I'm going to choose both buyer and seller. Um, I'm going to choose has email and subscribed to email. And I'm going to apply those filters. And as that's loading up, I'm also going to do buyer slash seller has email subscribed. Save that. And I've already actually created the email template. I was actually, I was on my game a little bit today. I wanted to save some time. And uh, and had that pre-made. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to. I went to marketing. I went to smart. Uh, I'm sorry, schedule mass email. I'm going to schedule a uh, an email here. I'm going to choose buyer slash seller has email subscribed. I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to send this tomorrow morning. I like to send my emails at eight in the morning. Which, by the way, if you aren't sending out. My, uh, the Friday morning email newsletter as prescribed in the free class that I offered Thursday, Friday, and Monday this past week. You absolutely need to do that. 
and we can help you with that. If you would like some help creating that, um, you know, we, we not for free um, because there's work involved. I would be happy to give you the recording for free so you can check that out. And we've got some free resources. But if you want us to actually help build that out, just comment below or better yet, email mike at growwithjosh.com. Mike at growwithjosh.com. Okay. But that's, a, you know, that's not today's, today's topic. So uh, I am going to, um, what was this called? Uh, Central... Oh, hopefully it's saved. Uh Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Stay home. Huh. All right. Bear with me for a minute. I tried to do the, uh, get some things knocked out ahead of time. It doesn't look like my work saved. Let me see here. So email. Oh, I think I may know what's going on here. Let me check something. Let me check something here. Uh Aha. I found, I found the issue. Let me uh, just do one thing here. And then. Bear with me here. Bear with me. Oh, it's still not working. Son of a gun. Well, um, let me see here. Let me see if I can show you it, even though it's not uh, cooperating to actually bring it up. Let me just make sure here. Yeah, so it's in there. I don't know what what is going on here. Sometimes KB Core gets a little goofy, but let me show you the email. And... um, While I'm bringing that up, let me let you know that if you comment below the word invite, comment below the word invite, Mike on my team, every week he compiles all of the resources, the scripts, the templates, everything that we share in here to make it as easy for you to R&D, rip off and, and deploy or duplicate or swipe and deploy. And uh, so if you comment below invite um, with one caveat that if you are watching the live stream and the live comment feed, um, you, I would highly recommend just email Mike at growwithjosh.com because we, we, for whatever reason, it is difficult for us to, uh, to get those. So let me share my screen here. Many of you are commenting invite, so that's good. So here is the email template. The subject line, a personal invitation for first name. Okay, a personal invitation for first name. The actual body of the email. This is a QR code that if someone scans it, will open a link to the app. And the link looks like this, where people can download it on the App Store or on Google Play. Which, by the way, I meant to include that in my email. Um, actually, let me think here. Where am I going to include that? Um, uh, I'm going to let them figure it out. I was going to include something in here about, uh, the fact that, you know, it, um, in the app store, uh, and Google play store, but regardless, they can figure that out. Um, so it is a QR code that when someone scans, it'll open that up. And then the text is, Hey, first name, I'd like to personally invite you to check out our brand new Central PA Home Search app. This is a screenshot of what it looks like on the iPhone. Uh, and then some some uh, some copy as to why. It has all the functionality of Zillow or Realtor app uh, of the, the Zillow or Realtor app with more accurate, comma, current listings and... And in all caps, we keep your info private, unlike those other apps. Check it out and let me know what you think. Joshvips.com forward slash app. So that's the email. I'll figure out what's going on and I'll get that scheduled to go out. Uh, But now that we've uh, dug into that email, let's go ahead. I'm going to go back over here and I'm going to do a different filter. I'm going to go to the smart CRM. We're going to do a different filter. 
and I'm going to text this invitation, this personal invitation out uh, to, um, and, and in this case, because I, I spent a, a good chunk of the morning following up with active leads, I'm just going to send this to the the uh, prospect or new, pro, I'm going to choose prospect or new, I'm going to choose contact details, I'm going to try to anyway. I'm going to choose, whoops, I'm going to choose buyer. And I'm going to say has phone, has email, subscribed to text, and apply filters. And again, because I actually prepared a little bit here, um, I'm going to uh, I'm copy the text that I have created. I want to show you, a, you know, a simple little thing um, that you could do. You know, if you've got a ton of people that you're texting, you may or may not want to do this little trick, but I thought of this this morning and I thought I would share it uh, and, and, and demonstrate it here is that um, I'm going to do this instead of sending one big chunk of text, I'm going to send the same list it in two different blocks. So I'm going to show you one example of doing this and then I'll show you a different example of it. Okay. So I'm going to select all. I'm going to choose mass text. I'm going to paste this in. Now I got to make sure that that's the right thing. So uh, morning, or um, I'm just going to put first name. First name. I'd like to invite you to check out our brand new Central PA Home Search app. Okay, that's it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to send that, and then. What I'm going to do is I've got the additional copy here. So once that sends, eventually, do, do, do. I'm going to actually choose the same grouping again. Once it loads back up. By the way, this personal invitation concept would is would be and is a great one to also send a video message around okay a video message around but that's we'll we'll cover that in a future session maybe actually um uh we'll probably do that in december uh and i'm going to send this to that same grouping it has all the functionality of the uh the zillow or realtor app with more accurate comma current listings and we keep your info private unlike those other apps uh, check it out and LMK what you think. Thanks, Josh. Okay. I'm just going to copy that. So that's how I can do that and send that as two different messages. But the reason being is it seems more, uh, you know, it could seem a little bit more natural to send it in two different messages. However, I could still send it as one big message. And in fact, I'm going to do that here in a minute. I'm going to go to a different page. And I'm just going to send it as one big chunked message as well, just to see. You can see different ways that you can you can uh, you can break this up and use this idea. Use this idea. Um, many of you already have, but make sure you comment below. Comment below. Invite if you would like the document that uh, Mike puts together each and every week that has all of the templates, scripts, resources, etc. from the session. If you are watching the live stream on YouTube, I would highly recommend uh, that you just directly email mike at growwithjosh.com. Mike at growwithjosh.com. Now, I've got a character limit here of 320, and you can see down here I'm over that limit. So I'm just going to delete that part. Um, and actually, look at this. If I get rid of that, thanks. Oh, and I'm under. Look at that. So I can get that in there. So I just basically put it all in one message. I'm going to go ahead and let that one rip there. And um, and there you have it. So I want to keep this short and punchy this week for a number of reasons. And it's still not even short and punchy. Um, so, so Adrian says, instead of an app, can I use a link to the search button on my website? Absolutely. Hey, I just wanted to personally invite you to come on back and check out 
all of the uh, the, the uh, available listings on our website and a link to that. Absolutely. I, I love that idea, Adrian. And this is a perfect illustration of how many of these scripts that I share on these Texting Tuesday sessions are really just frameworks that you can use with other things. So you can invite people to download and check out an app. You can invite people to search on your website. You could invite people to check out some new program or thing you're offering. You could invite people to some local event that you're hosting. You could invite people to a uh, um, a home buyer or home seller workshop. You could invite people to check out some new um, special financing program. Okay, the idea being you're personally inviting them, right? You're you're making them feel like you were thinking of them. And 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 how you you know you wanted to help them with some new thing that you're offering, okay? And the better you can make it about them, the more you can make it about them, um, the, you know, the better this will work for you, right? When you know, people are always looking or or receiving things and and at, through the lens of what's in it for me, right? W I F M W I I F M, right? That's our favorite radio station. It's a lame old cliche, I suppose. Um, but if you can put things in that term, in that frame, um, you, you know, that, that's the best way to do it. If you're struggling with how you can implement this idea, reach out, send us a private message, comment below with, you know, you know, what you're struggling with. And I'd be happy to come up with some ideas. Um, but, but there's no lack of, of ways that you can do this. And, and I would highly recommend, I would highly recommend that you go and check out in your MLS, find out if, if your MLS offers a, uh, a phone app that you can invite your contacts and clients to. Many MLSs have it, and some of them, they're pretty good. Um, they're actually pretty good. You may be using a platform that has it. So for example, KB Core um, has a, a, an app in there. I decided to invest into a, a custom app that, that folks can actually find in the App Store, uh, but that's not necessarily the best solution or the right solution uh for everyone uh and if you you know if you'd like more information about who we used for that just send me a private message shoot me an email or even text me Anne marie johns uh says i'm not i'm not super familiar with um what savvy card uh i have a savvy card and this is a good idea thanks uh, i don't know what savvy card is but it sounds like something that this would work great for so good on you for for finding how you can use this idea um, and, and, you know, uh, many times, um, many times this is about finding how you can utilize this script around whatever resources you have. Um, Kitty says, yes, I have a phone app right on Kitty. Good stuff. Uh, and KV core is coming up with a new app. Maybe they're updating the app. Um, I, that I'm not aware of, but it wouldn't surprise me. They are definitely constantly or uh, pretty consistently creating um, new resources and updating and so forth. So there you have it. Today's Texting Tuesday, the personal invitation, real estate text and email script. Uh, many of you have already done this, but comment below, invite. If you'd like the uh, copy of the document with all of the templates, scripts, resources, et cetera, shared in today's session. Um, if you're watching on the live stream, be sure to email mike at growwithjosh.com, mike at growwithjosh.com. Also, I would highly recommend you check out some of the recent videos that we've uploaded to the YouTube channel. There's some great stuff in there, including uh, one that will be released very soon, a new, um, a new sort of regular series that we're doing called the Monday Marketing Mastermind. Uh, and we had a great one yesterday, one that you will definitely want to check out if you're interested in utilizing short form video to get more clients. So definitely check that out. If you have any trouble finding it, comment below or just send us a private message. As always, as always, if you need anything whatsoever, we are here to help. Um, I would highly recommend you check out the additional resources above or below the video. And if you'd like to chat about partnering together and the three different ways that we can do that to help you grow and scale your business and make 2023 your best year ever, regardless of what's going on in the economy with recession and inflation and blah, blah, blah. Just uh, schedule a time to chat with me right there um, or just shoot me a, a private message or an email and we'll get something scheduled. Thanks so much. 
Have a great rest of the week and hopefully chat soon.